Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie here, and I'm here with some World Flippers, a new gacha I basically started. If you're unfamiliar with World Flippers, it's made by, it just recently released a couple days ago, not a couple days ago, but, you know, however many days ago. It's by Psy Games, the same people who did Dragalia, I believe, and it can really show because this game is awesome. It's really fun, it's got a lot of, like, neat systems that, um... I wish other gotchas had, honestly. This game is so good, it's kind of actually made it kind of impossible to go back to Ore Collection. Well, Jump Tyson, I should say. Because Jump Tyson feels like it's a year in the past, and this game feels like brand new. Like, has a whole bunch of cool ideas. So, let's get into it. I believe there's a new event, so let's do the event. Uh, I've not played this, so here's the basic thing. Here's my team. It's nothing special. It's two fives, a three... This one looks kind of like Medib from um, Ancient History, but also, more importantly, Fate Grand Order. Uh, let's just go into this event. I don't know what this event is. It looks like you're fighting a bunch of mushrooms. And here's what this game is. It is a pinball game. All right. Let's go. So what you basically want to do is try and get as many... Oh, I'm showing off this game pretty badly. I'm trying to get um, a combo of some kind going, but... Oh, there we go. So as you can see here, oh, oh, oh damn it, I messed that up badly. It's fine. Come on. Oh, I'm doing so bad on this, but this structure is weird looking. I'm used to like some pretty different. Okay. So there we go. All right. Come on, come on, come on. Much better. Much better. Much better. Okay, we're doing good now. Okay. I'm trying to explain, but also I'm doing a bad job because I'm not- There we go. Big old laser. You want to get as much pinball as you can. There we go. There we go. Yeah, this game is fun. Aw, oh, man, I screwed that up badly, didn't I? Do I have to beat a thousand of them? Is this what this event is? Okay, there we go. Much better. Yeah. I'll maybe do in the next thing, try to explain this. Oh god! Sometimes stuff just starts happening to you. Please, 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 please. Aw, oh, damn it. I messed that up completely. Yeah, I'm, I'm currently have a laser equipped to my pinball flippers. I'm not the greatest with it yet. So it's kind of pinball, but really it kind of reminds me more of Bubble Bobble with the, the way you want to kind of set things up. Um, doesn't really... Go there we go. There we go, get him right there. There we go, that's much better. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. That's good, that's good. Alright, we're to 500 down. Let's keep going, huh? Uh, it's pinball. That's kind of the way it is. It's funny because I'm trying to explain it. Oh, I messed that up again. Again, the laser I think is uh, pretty good for wide area of effects, but also it's super easy to just miss the laser and look like a dumb dumb. So yeah, you build up your skills. Okay, you build up your skills, you get the thing down there. Oh, come on. Get it, set it right there. Set it and forget it. Not bad, but the, wow, we're doing crazy good. Yes. Oh, damn it. Okay, let me go here. And the reason I have lasers in the bottom is because of the, the five character I had previously. The, my first character set is determining the five, the, the big old laser gun. And I think it changes depending on what kind of character you have as your leader. Uh, I know when I started off I had the three sword thing. Look at him go around. This is great. Yeah, this game is a whole lot of fun. World Flippers is the name. You should totally play it, I think. It's got a lot of cool gacha stuff. The starting rates is uh, for fives is 5%, so it's really good. Um, 
definitely better than some other games. Uh, currently, still. Even games that I love a whole bunch. You know, there we go. Sometimes I miss with that, and I don't know what to do with it. Get more, come on, get more. I only need 83 something more. And then we'll be done with this. But yeah, that's kind of why I also played Pokemon Pinball last time, is because I just was reminded. Okay, there we go. I don't think any of my skills are up right yet, so. Come on, get it. There we go, that should be it. Yes, that should be it. Quest clear. Okay. Did it! Alright, let's see if I can. I was able to get double SS. Hey, not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, but also, oh damn! I wish they leveled up because they have some beautiful animations in this game, especially for um, the five characters. Um, you get to see them every time they level up too. Ooh, not bad, not bad. All right, I finished that. Yeah, I'm just screwing around with this for a bit. Um, in terms of video for today. Oh, excuse me. Sorry for the burps. All right, let's go in here. Let's go into this battle. Yeah, I've been just kind of making my way through. Um, oh, damn it, I forgot to explain. Okay, I'll, I'll explain uh, next time. But here's the basic thing is that you constantly are going up. The more enemies you hit, the more of a meter starts that um, the higher the meter gets, the more you do uh, damage to stuff. Um, oh, come on. Uh, if you click attack, if you click the, the whatever you get to do this attack that I'm doing right here, so you see, they'll attack and they'll try and aim for whoever's closest to them. I miss with that completely again. Alright, zone clear. So usually what the first step is, is getting enough enemies to get zone clear, and then you get a boss battle. And then for boss battles, ooh, I should have tried to avoid that, but I couldn't. There we go. I was able to avoid that, at least. Oh, damn it. Did I miss? No, I didn't. Oh, that's good. Okay, this thing is dead. Alright, I'll go into the tame screen and I'll actually explain some of this stuff now. Quest player. I think it's pretty self-explanatory, though. Uh, double SS, I got it again. Oh, did anyone level up? No. I should save for in case of great animations. Okay. Let me quickly show the front of it right here. Okay. Here's your team. Um... The leader in the front determines what happens when you get a uh, combo bonus that you saw right there. Like when you saw the flipper turn orange and green, that was me building up the combo. And depending on who's in the front determines what the characters will do. Sometimes it's a laser beam. Sometimes it changes like how your dudes attack. Like um, I think when one character was in the front of it, you did a spinning sword attack. Um, you pick three. And then... The as you attack more enemies, your skills build up, your attack skill, and if you go, the middle one is up, you swipe up, the left one is swipe left, the, the right one is swipe right. And then there's also, you can combo ping, combo them up with other units you have, and that will change how the effect runs. So as you can see here, um, my girl on the right here did not have the ability to cause a giant healing wave. What she does is that she does that giant beam, but then the secondary effect, which is creating a whole bunch of like healing stuff, was created by the other one. So that's kind of how the basic game goes. Um, there's a bunch of other stuff that you could look into, honestly. Um, we have a small tab for it in Trash Alliance for anyone that plays it, but really I just talked to my fellow co-founders. They told me to pick it up, and they were right. It's fantastic. There's so many good things about it. I'll, I'll even, we'll end this with a summon and stuff, but and hopefully I can show off the summon animation, but this game's just fun. There's like, there's, it's hard to say like why it's fun other than you need to play it. Also, I'm doing bad on this. Okay. Butter. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on, are you serious? There we go. Come on. Now that we're up here. Uh, I wanted to kill him. It's fine. Who is this punk guy? Okay. I keep constantly missing with that move. I don't know. Okay, so when that happens with a boss, you need to hit it so that it break. So that they break. Because they'll do a big move if you don't break it. 
Okay. Not bad, double SS. Any animations? No one leveled up, it's fine. Okay. So here's some of the cool things I want to- Ooh! I got a hamster man. Cool. I like hamsters. Here's one of the things I mentioned that were pretty cool. I don't know any other gacha does it, so if your gacha does this, tell me. Um, you'll notice that I completed this mission. I didn't need to select it to say that I had done it. <laughs> it just automatically does it for you. And let me tell you, I love games um, like uh, Bounty Rush and a whole, but there's a whole mess load of games I love out there. They do not have this feature. This is the most infuriating thing. The, per the one that pisses me off the most is Bounty Rush, because Bounty Rush has a thing where it doesn't record your extra things for skill orbs if you don't accept the mission and it gets super annoying so i love that they did this i think it's great so let's end this with a multi um world, the, the game is world flippers you should honestly check it out i think it's really cool i'm really impressed with side games has done uh and i'm gonna definitely keep it around also don't summon on this this is a weapon gotcha also, it's super easy to, to re-roll, too. If you want to re-roll, I'll show it at the end of this. Um, at the title screen, there's a button in the front that you press. Um, it's like a, the trash can in a folder. It will completely delete your file. And then you can also skip the tutorial. So it's actually super easy to actually re-roll in this game. So it's pretty cool. All right. Let's do the 10. I don't really need anyone. I just want to do a multi to end this. Let's see if we can get a 5. Let's see. How many? We got a couple fours in there. Alright, not bad. Okay. I don't know what any of these dudes' names are. Or ladies. Dudes and ladies. Ooh, okay. He's new. That's cool. Is this person new? Yes. This is a dude. I can hear in the voice. This is a girl. She's a maid with a gun. I might start using her because she seems cool. What the hell is this? <laughs> I take it back. I'm using this guy. This is. <laughs> That's a guy and a penguin. Alright. I don't know what you're saying. You don't seem cool though. Ooh, Robo Man. I don't know what's up with this world, but there's a lot of weird characters in it. Some of them are fantasy, and then some of them are just crazy Japanese stuff. <gasps> okay, so here's the pachinko thing. If I get that, I might... Oh, yes! That means I'm getting a 5. No, I'm getting a 4. This means it was a... No, it's a 5? That's a 4. That means that was a 3 ball. It got upgraded to a 4. You have to pray to the pachinko gods that you do good. On that one. Do you have extra arms, dude? Yeah, yeah, I think you do. Alright, that's that summon. I'm glad that I was able to show off the Pachinko. Um, you can definitely have the Pachinko fail, by the way. The Pachinko does not guarantee you an upgrade of what you have. So yeah, that's World Flippers. My review of it is, check it out. It's awesome. Alright everyone, until next time, if you like this video, leave a like. If you liked me, you should subscribe to me and you should check out some more of my videos. I play a whole bunch of the games. And with that, I gotta say goodbye. Have a good day, everyone. Also, thank the double upload today to Salem from Fake Grand Order. Goodbye.